is going on everyone this is scream truth here and we are gonna go over the behind the scenes october 2013 yep the year's getting close to over now and we got a few updates a lot of them gonna be halloween involved but um my opinion based on going through it uh not many of them are too important now the lumbridge rebuild is going to be the october holiday event um Essentially, you're going to be rebuilding Lumbridge with a guy, his name is Foreman George, he's going to lead the project. And you're going to just rebuild everything, um, earn XP, emote, and unique costume from around Lumbridge. Explorer Jack's hat, the title, and a title you can earn. Um, all this is going to help take apart the camps set up by the gods and rebuild the city and during rune fest there's going to be a monument built in tribute to those who gave their lives in the battle um the elder and crystal tree high level skilling update now for those of you guys who don't have 99 woodcutting yet you should be really happy about this one and for those of you who just want to get the next tier up logs you can do so these are level 90 and 94 logs here at level 90, you'll be able to cut elder trees, and elder trees are pretty cool. That also does mean that you'll be able to make um, elder short bows and elder shield bows, and that also I think that also means when you go for crystal trees that you're going to be able to make crystal bows, so you're finally able to make those items, which is pretty cool. Um, as you can see, this is not the Elder Tree, it's kind of cool, and this is the Crystal Tree. Now, I think that the Crystal Tree is only going to be located in the Tirawin area, but that's still pretty cool. It says that you will have to hunt them down, so they will, like, appear and disappear or something. Um, and it's really nice to see a little bit more elf content, because at the very end it says, there's a few nice surprises for elven-eyed players to spot a long and chance to break off crystal geodes, which contain a valuable gem, crystal seeds, or crystal triskelions. And that's pretty cool. Um, but yes, both of these trees act slightly different in game, so new tactics, collaborations will be needed to create the most out of them. We've also increased the level of the dark bow to 70, and its stats accordingly. Um, the serenic armor. This is level 90 range armor. This, act this armor is actually not going to need um, boss fighting to get. You're only going to need to fight creatures from 74 to 99 Slayer to obtain these um, scales. And this is what the scale looks like right here. And apparently the best thing to hunt for these scales are in the Ascension Dungeon. And you can string them all together to make the armor from Ocellus, the guy who's like at the entrance of that dungeon. And that's pretty cool. Craft craftable by level 90 to 93 and stitch together using the thread. Um, this gear looks really cool. Um, I'm actually probably going to go for this myself because I'm almost done with 99 Thieving. And the next place I'm going is Strength, Slayer, and uh, Range. So... I'm pretty excited for it. Um, Missing Presumed Death. It's the next quest in the 6 Age series. This is the first of a brand new quest line coming in. And apparently Death has been kidnapped. And Aetherian, god of the underworld, has to take over his place while he is gone. Um, I think that this is going to be a pretty cool quest. Uh, apparently tons of lore can go into this uh if you do more quests you're going to receive a lot more like options to go through which is really cool and it makes me want to go ahead and do some more quests i have about 35 more quests before i have that cape so yeah i might have to do some more quests in the future and um there's more basically means that they're putting more stuff in the general store but the coolest thing is that um Golden Chip Jambas are coming back for free at Solomon's General Store, or a cheap price, 
of loyalty points or rune coins for free players. So Squishy is going to be reincarnated and put in my house where he can be safe forever. Don't worry that these guys are non-combustible. So that's good. That's good to hear. I miss Squishy. So with that being said, guys, um, what do you think about this BTS? Comment below, let me know. Give a thumbs up if you like this video, and we'll see you all next time.